Hey, resume. What is up, guys? Air just cause here once again with a lot of the high side, basically. And tonight, we are here with the not a street course 400 at Chicagoland. I'm uh, Air just cause, of course. We're gonna have smoke and join in a little bit. Um, but tonight, we are here. Chicagoland should be fun. No way. Caleb got lagged out before lap one. Oh, wow. Caleb. Caleb, your internet had one job. One measly job. Here we go, we're loading in. Okay, well, here we go. As Caleb is in front of B13 as he is lagged out. Here we go. Green flag here from Chicago. Here we go. In the one, B13 on the inside. Colin... On the outside, here comes Savage on the inside of the 24 here off of turn number two. Can he get there? Doesn't look like it's not. Down the back straightaway, 24 right behind the 12. What's the 24 do? Here he's going to go down the inside of the 12 through three and four. Side-by-side -side battle. Oh, 24 not clear off of four, but he might be entering one. But he's going to leave lap number one. Right, hop on in. <laughs> well, we're going to get Caleb uh, and Smoking. We're going to have a three man booth tonight. We're going to have Caleb and Smoking. Um, the two people that have beef. The, dude, the two people that have beef. One's in the. Well, both of them are in the booth. Mm, oh, 24 in the wall. Oh, no, but y'all like to talk hella shit, though. Here we go. Down the inside is the 12. Oh, 12 on the inside of the 24 here. Caleb. Caleb's going to be in the booth. Well, you talk a lot of shit. I know. It's Caleb, though. Come on. Who doesn't talk shit about Caleb? Oh, that is true. Hi, Caleb. <laughs> <laughs> Love you, Caleb. We've already started. <laughs> We've already started. Okay, Caleb, you got your audio included? Okay, I'll send you. Yeah, I need invite. an invite to the I'll thing. Send you an invite. Hold on. I'll invite y'all separately because I don't want to send it to the party. But the <laughs> 24 down the inside for the lead, and he might clear here in the three and four if he gets good enough momentum. <laughs> mm hmm. Yeah. Smoking, did you get the invite? It's the 24 away to the lead. Oh, yeah. Caleb's gonna be right back, okay? Tell me when you're in. Um I'm fine. So the twenty-four up to the lead with the twelves in P2. They got a nice little gap to third, which is the two a ding. Here we go in the turns three and four. Twelve got good momentum here. Should have a nice decent run out of turn number four. But out of four, it looks like he went a little wide off exit. He's going to go to the inside of the 24, though, for the lead. Oh, 12, 24, trying to hang on to the outside. He's doing a good job here off of turn number two. He's going to get a little bit of that run, but a little side draft from the tw uh, 12. I, I, that was kind of an unintentional side draft, but here we go through three and four. 12 looking inside. This is bringing that second group into play. Well, that second group's got three cars. It looks like the two, the five, and the one. Yeah, you can see the two, the five, and the one. That's going to bring the top five back to the top two drivers up front. And then the rest of the pack is six on back right now. As you can see, they're swarming back there in that second pack, smoking. Yeah, and look at the 12 coming to the inside now. The 24 for the lead with the two, his teammate, right behind him. Maybe going three wide here. Come down the front straightaway, Eric. Oh, he looking three. He looking three. Oh, they're three, three wide. wide. They're three wide. Will Andy make it four? Does he have the balls to? Does he have the balls? 
<laughs> I mean, we're talking about we're talking about Andy. Yeah, Andy. Andy has no balls to take oh, a four wide. Oh, two washed up. Twenty fours in the wall. Oh, they're okay. They're too wide. Here comes Andy to the inside of the two for the lead. <laughs> oh, well, the, the two twenty four not lead. happy. Yeah, twenty four. <laughs> Not happy, but the t two is because the two is your leader here in Chicago. Yeah, but don't count out that five. He's there too, and neither so is that twenty four coming back three wide, <laughs> looking to fill three wide for a second. Well, hey, he he was looking at it. He was that that hole was n nice for him to fill, but you know he didn't take it. So, but now he's he's doing fill it now. It. Three <laughs> wide. Oh, now there two is the five. I think. Uh, just didn't have the momentum or just backed out of it. I love, I love, um, I love the 24s and I love the 24s answers. I'm back. <laughs> yeah. As, uh, we got Caleb here, uh, we're going to send an invite to Caleb to make sure his thing works. Um. Oh, do we have to? Yeah. I don't want to have Caleb all alone. Darn. Myself. <laughs> <laughs> As the as 24 sitting P2, nice little bow for P3 though. B13 and uh, the five of Andy, a little side by side bow for third there, smoking. Okay, smoking. Uh, here we go, nice analysis there. Here we go into one and two, nice little side by side battle. They're still side by side. It looks like the 12s carrying good momentum oh until a little contact from the five put the 12 in the wall just the tiniest bit of contact from the five i don't know why just sent him way up the racetrack so um caleb did that invite work and everything yes sir i am here and audio is included okay well uh sadly your car is uh you know did not get going on lap one <laughs> Let's just say that uh, as we're looking at your Bush light car on pit road. Um, but what is going to be expectation as a driver that has ran here at Chicago land? What's going to be that expectation today? Keeping it clean, not getting too loose at the end of runs off a of turn two. I mean, mile and a half on this game is insane when it comes to getting off of turn two at mile and a half besides Texas. Um, being there at the end and making sure those tires last you the full fuel run. Yeah, definitely indeed. This is one of the underrated tracks, I feel like, for tire wear. You don't really think tire wear when you go to Chicagoland, but those tires do really wear here. Yeah, they do. Yeah. Um, Coming from experience in the B-Series. Yeah, as uh, smoking, you know, a big aspect of this race will be pit road. This is one of the more unique ways of pitting here in the league, going through the apron of three and four. We've seen a lot of mistakes there throughout the seasons. What's going to be the expectation to get perfect on and off pit road? Well, definitely slow it down, but not too much, so you can hit that apron and not spin it out like a couple people did in the B-Series. So, I mean, like you said, it is one of the toughest pit roads to get on. And after racing Sunday, it, it, it's not fun. <laughs> yeah, I mean. It was not it was not fun to get on and off pit road. Well, we'll see how the cup drivers take it today. As Ding is up front, 24 and second. We're going to go on board with, let's go on board with. The, the 66 of Texas Terry who gets doored by the 14 right there back into the 19 I don't know what happened there but you know, a little contact between the 14 and the 66 right there as we're on board him you can look at the rest of the field you can barely see the leaders but you can see the bow for third there between the 5 and the 12 12 on the outside 5 on the inside there there that the car is way up ahead and then up ahead of them is the leaders so, you can see a nice little side-by-side -side battle here, Caleb. Yeah, it's uh, not a bad side-by-side -side battle. I mean, that five car is always fast here, and so is that 12. Um, so, they also have been getting into it, seems like, every single time the last couple weeks. So, they're going to be side-by-side -side for quite a few laps here, possibly. Yeah, oh, little contact again. Going to put the 12 almost in the wall. God, they cannot stop hitting each other. 
I don't know what's going on between the 5 and the 12 recently. Uh, everyone knows about the Roval a couple weeks ago, where they just were beefing, it looked like, throughout the whole race. And, you know, and then and then New Hampshire, the, the send at New Hampshire that wrecked the 5 at the end of the race. I mean, these two have been probably making the most co contact with each other the last couple weeks in the whole field combined. I mean, it has been wild between the 12 and the 5, smoking. Yeah. I mean, I I, know I have my share of beefs in the B series, but from what I'm hearing, I mean, it and from what I can see, it has been interesting. But I mean, they're racing each other pretty clean right now, Air. Yeah, they're racing Five's each other. Pretty room. Clean. Yeah, they're racing each other cleaner than people race you. Um. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I know, right? Uh, by the way, you're beefing with at least somebody once per every race. I don't know mm -hmm. why the whole or has the whole field not obliterated you. I'm just putting it out there. There's <laughs> oh, the one in the five. Oh, the 12. The 12 spins it. Those around. Uh, looks like someone else is around. Oh, someone else is around. The 19's around. The 22 is slow. No caution. No caution. Yeah, 19. So, did the t did he collect anybody? So, we got more cars entering pit road. Okay, collected the 22. Saw, yeah, Somebody was around before involved. him as well. You can, we have to look at that, too. There was a car around before him. It was a red car. Um... I saw the 19 spin when the 20, uh, the, uh, not 20, but the, um, 12 was spinning. No, 19, 19 avoided him. Well, no, he, well, he avoided him, but he wrecked himself, I guess. I don't know. That it might have been, it might have been, ding. no, it wasn't ding. It might have been, um. Well, it was a Bass Pro Shop car, and the three car, I it, don't think, is in the field. It might have been, it might have been the 22. I know the 22 is full red this week. He's in that throwback. Mm hmm. I like Kyle Larson's throwback looks pretty badass. Oh, yeah, it's a throwback nice back to Tony Stewart. I'm not going to reveal all my favorite throwbacks, so I'm kind of saving that for a video later this week. Um, well, there's too many. I feel like I feel like there's a lot of throwbacks to Harvick. And there's also uh, a lot of throwbacks to Dale Jarrett. There's not that many throwbacks to Harvick, actually. I've only maybe there's, seen three throwbacks. To there's Harvick. more to uh, Dale Jarrett, though. Yeah, Dale Jarrett. Dale Jarrett's got like four or five this weekend. Yeah, most of them are in Cup. Anyway. But it's like I said. Um, this week, this weekend, or I should say on Friday, should be expecting a little throwback ranking video uh, coming your way. I want to rank well, maybe all I'll the watch throwbacks. It. Maybe I'll watch it when I get to PA. So, so that should be fun. Well, the two, I think the two cycled out to the lead again here, Caleb. Is uh, you know, you're the little master of strategy around here. Um. What's the best strategy you think is going to be taken throughout the race here uh, in the stages and then that final stage? Well, it's really much going to come down to um, where the cautions fall. Um, don't hit the wall. <laughs> um, and it's just going to be, in my opinion, this is a track where you have to run it out as long as possible. I don't think short pitting is going to make a difference here. Um, it, I mean... The 22 car is known for his short pitting. I think he'll get some spots, but I honestly don't think the 2 and the 24 are going to... It's going to make a difference to them. They're going to just well, have to run their race all the way to the end of the fuel fuel runs and tire runs. So we'll, we'll see Aaron, what happens. I mean, if you watch, if you watch the uh, B series, I don't know if you have watched the video, but I mean, two tires could also come into play. Lyle did it. Made it work. All the way to the finish so honestly i could see some two tire strategy maybe come in if it's a if it's a late race or early before if a caution doesn't come out 
I mean, yeah, Lyle did make those two tires work multiple times um, on uh, Sunday. So I would not be surprised if, you know, two tire stop would be uh, would be in the cards for anybody for either a stage end or a race end. But um, how many to go do we have in stage one? Coming to five. Okay. Thirteen? So who said five? Someone said five. I swear. I swear on. Every... I heard it too. I heard it too. Yeah, yeah. And you, and you yelled the B series. The B series was actually on point with their timing, with their laps on on Sunday. Someone said five. Hey, I will gladly take no points for Canadian Tire. I got my payback on my guys. I am done. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> As, uh, let's go back to the two. Yeah. And it's also it's, it's also just uh any so Andy's had bad luck fun. in the five. Fine. Uh, here we go through three and four. But here's the thing, Andy. He's also had the the trend of giving up the play, the championship on the last race too. So except for the one time that he didn't. Mm -hmm. Well, yeah. Also, smoking. Let's try and not take out anybody this week. Oh. No, trust me. I'm I'm going for the win at Daytona. Blows are uh, off. I'm, going I'm for already win. hearing that four Toyotas are gonna purposely sit behind you for the win. So mm -hmm. yeah, they're gonna the laugh. They're gonna, they're gonna finish me. dead last in the Daytona race. Oh yeah, I really tried my best out there. I got my hands up on the steering wheel and white knuckled the whole thing and crashed out on the last lap. Caleb, if I win the Daytona race and get a shot to race in the in the A series. That ain't my call. I'm telling it with you. It's gonna be, it's gonna be fun. <laughs> okay, well. That I'm honestly looking forward. I'm honestly looking forward to Daytona. Oh my God. So he's Bubba. So he's Bubba. <laughs> I'm still, I'm still mad about last season where I had the chance to race in the in the A series at Iowa and my fucking internet crashed. That was hilarious. That was not hilarious. That pissed me the f off. Okay, it made me laugh. It made a couple Say people it. laughs. laughs. <laughs> okay, it pissed me the fuck off. How's that? <laughs> God. It wouldn't be a race without Smokin' being pissed. Uh, <laughs> or at least it's something. Smokin's got beef in the booth, too. Dude, dude wow. he got beef in the booth. He got beef in the track. He got beef in the fridge. He got beef in the cooler, bro. He's got beef at Wendy's. He got beef at Wendy's? Yeah, bro. Man got beef everywhere, bro. I'll tell you what. Friday is going to be hell. He's got... He's... Uh, Bro, oh, no, bro, Andy, I got to get up oh, early, yeah. go take Holly's car to Winchester, Sm get that um, smoking, inspected, we don't care. And, then, and then come back and get them to go to PA. We don't care, smoking. Literally, smoking is literally the Hannibal Lecter of Highside. He just loves a bunch of beef. Hey, well, let's see. The 34 deserved it that one day. And the 16 deserved it, had it coming for a while. Since Martinsville. Okay, what about the 20 on the prior B Series season? Oh, the 20 was just an ass. I'm sorry. He was a complete asshole through that series. And he never showed the fuck back up after I took care of him. Oh.
Andy, Andy said that so slow, I thought he was having an aneurysm. <laughs> like... <laughs> it's so refrigerized in me. Okay, how many to go on the stage? Okay, three. Coming to three to go, okay. Well, here we go. Coming to three to go in the stage as we just got done having the smoking therapy session. Um, we got three to go here, Caleb. Yeah, that two car seems to have just run away with it. So, I mean, 24 looking pretty strong in second place right now. But and then hopefully no teams way. get their s setups in. Yep. Stage break. Well, we're coming to two to go here, so coming to two to go on the stage. It looks like he could lap the 19 here of Matrix. Not shocking. As Killer, yeah, as Killer is not here today. Uh, I heard he was busy. That's with big. Yeah, so yeah, that's big in points and playoffs. Is you know the playoffs are coming around the uh, coming around the corner. So oh, we're coming to one to go here for the stage. You got the 19. You know, just going high here for the two. The thing is, I'm shocked he wasn't lapped sooner. That's all I'm saying. Okay, here we go. One to go. Stage number one. He's got a really big gap over the 24 here. He's got to just be careful with the race car. Doesn't even really need to push it here for the stage. Just here we go. Down the back and into turns. Three and four. The two a ding is going to come out of turn number four and win stage number one here from Chicago. Did a little victory spin out there for the stage. The five of Andy, I think, brings it home third. So. Oh, uh, Denver, Denver's up 33-20? Hey. Denver, Denver really wants revenge. Hmm. For game two, or for game three and four. And the way this game started, it looks, Ten four. looks like the ending of Boston Philly. Oh. Uh. Well, let's see. This uh, stage two should be interesting. And should be good. Can't wait to see how how it goes through here as the 24 and the two on the front row. Here we go. Restart zone. Green flag. Oh, a little nice. 37 laps in stage two. Here we go in the one. 24 on the inside, two on the outside. Can the two hold on? That's going to be the question. A little contact between the two. Off of turn number two, down the back. Oh, the five went to the outside. That was not a smart move. Here comes Just looking for second. Just looking for P2 here on the two out of four. Oh, 24. He's going to push 24 here down the front straightaway. Can he clear the two? That's the question. Looks like Hendrick fans trying to follow through with the 88. Still side by side for second through th one and two here, Caleb. Yeah, I'm not surprising. Those cars are all strong cars there. Um, 37 laps in this stage. I believe they're going to have to pit twice here unless a caution comes out. Um, so, I mean, it's going to be a pretty good stage here to see what everyone's got going and getting ready for that final stage. Yeah, definitely a deed here. Uh, smoking uh, stage two. What, what do you think is going to happen here in this stage? I mean, oh, from what I was back. just heard, big, oh, wreck in the back. Oh, big wreck in the back. It's the 12. Is in it. Five is in it. Eight's in it. 
I see the eight. Caution. Caution now. So caution out for the first time for incident today. Early on, stage two. Could this affect any strategy here, Caleb? I think it could actually change it. Thank you, Caleb, for the wonderful analysis. Well, Caleb was busy with admin stuff, so I had to jump in and say something, okay? <laughs> Oh. Okay. Well, here we go. 2488 front row. Here we go. Green flag. Here we go. In the one. Uh, Caleb was more on board with it, so Caleb should make the call. Here we go. Two to the lead. Can he clear 24? Oh. Okay. Oh, nice little run from the 88 here. A little push here. He's going to look down the inside of the two. Oh, 24 gives a two. A nice little no no square touching there in the one and two. Out of two. Down the back. Oh, now he's going to push to try to push the 88, but now he's going to go to the outside of the 88. 88 down the inside of the two. Two's trying to get that outside lane going. Off of turn four. This is getting a little interesting here, Caleb. Yeah, it definitely is up here at the front. Um, I mean, I'm I'm looking at the back here and the gaggle going on back here to see if there's any possible wrecks brewing. Um. They're all fighting for position out here, trying to make this work. It seems like they've gotten into a nice little train here, trying to get to stay in the same pack, except for at the front. 88's on the inside of the two, though, which good for the 88. He's had a little down year, it sounds like. I mean, as you put it, washed. <laughs> uh, I've said that for the last couple seasons. <laughs> I'm just quoting air. Well, he's a Daytona 500 winner, that's it. <laughs> it's true, true, true. Oh, a little contact. By the way, let's also give a shout out to the 48 Assault. Assault in that 48. Oh. Oh, as soon as I... As, he... <laughs> as soon as I say something about the 48, he decides to whack his teammate. Commentator curse. <laughs> the 48 decided to whack off his teammate. Two goes to the inside of 88. 48 to the inside of the two. We got a big How about Salt coming for, for the lead. lead. Yeah, Salt Whoa. coming for the lead here. Smoking. With help from Andy. With help from Andy. Andy's going to look to the inside. This is a bad. Uh, they're th wide. They're oh, second. contact there. Th they're three wide. They're three wide. Oh, the they're, they're still the lead three off wide. The two. Oh, but they're three wide. Oh. And he wants a shot back at the lead. Salt's doing a little uh, block in there. Oh, 18 right behind the five as well. 48 up the racetrack a little bit. Can he play Two's defense? Two's a fight on that high side. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, 24 <laughs> with a massive run. He's going to look three wide on the two. Three wide for the lead. <laughs> oh, 12's oh, a little hard. Going. Oh, we got a crash. Oh, the track. They're kind of crashing. They're kind of crashing. But They're trying to the crash. outside of Salt for the lead. Well, they and saved it, but they look like they were trying to crash there. But we still got a battle. 48 sends the oh, two dang. up the track. Salt will lead that lap. Here comes here comes the 24 to the outside. Does the 48 door the 24? That's going to be the question. <laughs> 48 doesn't have the balls to do it again, I bet you. 24 is just strong on that high side. He just power moved out of two. Yeah, 48 going to lose the lead. Here comes Hendrick looking for second. 
As high side Hobie's gonna take that lead once again here. Smoking. Yeah, what a what a power move out of turn two on that high side. Uh, but I don't think they're done yet. I think I think uh, Hendrick wants a shot at this second spot. And here comes Ding going trying to go three wide going into one. Ding's pissed, I I think. He's he's pissed deep down in his heart right now. I definitely know it. He lost the lead. <laughs> yeah. Ding, the flies well, are really, wanna... really hot. Air smoking. Look at that look at that car out there in sixth place right now. Sneaky is that a making rare... his way towards the front. Is that a rare that one? Pablo Montoya into the jet dryer siding? Mm -hmm. I believe it is. Oh my god. Wow. He's just well, quietly working his way up here. Oh, uh, until you said something, and then now he went up the racetrack, and he's possibly going to lose a spot or two. <laughs> well. So. Well, at least he's not hitting a jet dryer or anything. Uh, well, he is the jet dryer. <laughs> what do you mean? To the inside of the 24 for the lead. Yeah, inside for the lead, and Smokin's lost his <laughs> mind like he usually does. <laughs> 24 trying to fend off a bunch of cars as he's up front in the lead, but the two looking down the inside. Two's going to hit the apron. 48's going to get a shot to go down the inside here. Hey, Ding, stop stop messing with Caleb's wife. <laughs> so, well, this has got a little interesting. Um, oh, 24 hit the seam. Two with the little run. So here we go in the one and two, two and 24. Oh, uh, the two with a massive run here down the back. Oh, oh, 24 is blocking. No, two went way outside. Oh, are we sure? Cause uh, I think I just saw 24 go outside it, the middle. Well, it looked like who's pit. It looked like the two. Well, anyway, Ooh, battle for the lead. Pit, a little short pit for the Lee. Two looking Shocking. inside. I mean, well, Caleb did call that, literally. Yeah. I mean, what would be least surprising is Hunter Boy short pin. He's whittle well, whittying on the whack. Well, here's, here's the thing. Hunter Boy, Hunter Boy did that at, oh, at Martinsville, but still won the race. Remember? Yeah. And he put it on two. He got, yeah, I think he got two tires that race, too. Well, pit stops should be happening soon. You know, with that 22 taking a little short pit. But this battle for the lead, though, might be spilling on the pit road when these guys pit 24 and 2. Currently, 1 2. They got a nice little gap to third, which third is about between the 1 and the 88. 88 the finally found his groove today. It looks like. Oh, 14 up the racetrack. Oh, 14 to the 5. God, they so here's are a question here. Battle. Here's a question. If you're the two, do you try to get them on entry, or do you just ride behind them coming out of the road? I would ride behind them until pit stops, because if you start battling intensely, that third place pack is going to literally catch you. Well, I'm so, saying, do you make the move? Do you go for the pass going into pit road? No, that because you could possibly wreck going on a pit road. We've it's talked true. about how dangerous pit road entry has been and how unique it is. You know, if it's dangerous with you being by yourself on the apron, why in the world would you make it more dangerous and pass? Because smoking's not smart. <laughs> I mean, we've known that, uh, Caleb. I think we've known that. <laughs> hey, me being crazy here in the booth would not be me without... It wouldn't be the booth without me being crazy at least once. The only thing is, at least you haven't messed up on any words recently. <laughs> well, I mean, never mind. Oh, oh thanks, know. Colin. <laughs> <laughs> that is kind of true. <laughs> I mean, I mean, I mean, I'm, I do say, I do say, Michigan again, I, and then I, we start sometimes. I will so admit, the biggest. The most hilarious thing he has missed said <laughs> is at Kentucky a couple seasons ago in the All-Star Race where he said, Andy has the Cardi B. 
He has the Cardi B, bro. That will. <laughs> I think I remember that. I be the hilarious that. thing he has ever said in the booth. What? What? Um. What was that? The Real Spin series? Uh, I don't think it was the Wheel Spin series. It was the uh, All Star Race when we did Cup. Oh, two? It's the two pin? No, he's slowing down no, the inside of the twenty-four. The oh, there is a car back there. That's oh, pinned. five. It's the five. Five pin. Like Caleb said, I think these two are running it, running, running their tank dry. Eighty-eight's on pit road. Yeah, eighty-eight's on pit road. Side by side, still for the lead. It's gonna oh, oh contact. low contact. Oh. This is gonna bring in that one though. I mean, this they would be going interesting. Side by side. Oh, here we go through three and four. Is Twenty-four. Still there. Two's he's got still him. there. No, he's still there. Oh, uh, he's yeah, still just he's barely. on that corner panel. He's on that panel. Oh, and he's going to get a good run here through one and two with that send. Tw I was going to say, yeah, that's where the 24 oh, was fast. 24 and two are going to pin. Two. This is going to get interested. Oh, here we go. Two backed out of it. Nope. Two's going to two oh. hits him. The two hits him. 24 <laughs> saves it. What a save by the 24, oh, though, and then on he that hits one. Him again. <laughs> oh, the 24 black flag. Ouch. Oh, my God, Caleb. What happened? <laughs> what happened? Uh... Like I said, aggression, aggression. The twenty, the two went for it. I told you he might make a move on pit road. What happened? I told you he might go for the lead, going into pits. That's gonna be a big. Yeah, that's gonna be big, especially for the stage, because the two I think is gonna be by himself. I think. No, nope, he's got the one coming out. Yeah, but you think. The one's going to be able to keep up with the two is what we saw last uh, last run. 22 uh, I don't know, oh, but yeah. the 22 is the leader. And he's got a massive gap. Look at this gap. The next car just exited out of turn two now. And he's about to wow. enter three and four. He has a massive gap here, Caleb. Explain to me what this strategy is on the long run that he's trying to do. So he short pitted, which means he had fresher tires. But now... Those fresher tires are going to be running him down. And the question is, is does he have enough laps to stay out front or are they going to catch him down, run him down? Because it mean, I mean, I'm looking, I'm on board with the 22 looking backwards right now. And it seems like those cars behind them are coming quick. Well, I mean, Caleb, like I said, Kyle, uh, Lyle took two tires late in the race and he, and Jack ran him down pretty quick, but not quick enough. Depending yes, Smokin, much... but the problem is is that the B series runs a different sure. uh, we know. where fuel and oh, yeah and tire um, wear. Yeah, tire so... wear and lap counts. So sometimes it can transfer over and sometimes it does not transfer over. Not to mention the cars behind the twenty two right now are nose to tail drafting with each other, which is gonna make them go faster and catch the twenty two faster. <laughs> that yeah, they is are true, but if bit. they start battling, it will kinda stall out though. We've seen it already in this race where you go side by side, cars start pulling away. I feel like if they can stay single file and draft, they can catch now what what, what Smoking alluded to. I still think it can happen. If if we get long run, if you're the 22, yeah, they're catching them probably pretty fast now. They're probably catching about a second, maybe nine tenths, eight tenths. But if you can get it late in the run to where they're barely gaining anything, you can have a pretty safe chance of winning the stage. If you can get it late in the run to where they're only gaining two tenths, one tenth, like three tenths a lap, you you, you feel a little more comfortable with that. Yes, but you also want to understand that that's not the two there. That's the five and the 88 that are trying to mm -hmm. run down this 22. Teammates, and they're running them down, too. I'm on board with just right now. They are gaining on them. But that two is climbing into the picture and may battle with them. That's probably the 22's well. hoping break right there. It's how many to go? Six to go in stage two. 
I this... think it's gonna be close. They this... might just they might catch him literally on the last lap. So we're hearing they gain six tenths with now six to go. Now you gotta hope if you're the 22 that the next couple laps they only gain maybe two two or three tenths. Because now the 2 is right behind the 5 and the 88. And you better hope the 5 and the 88 give the 2 car the best battle of his life. There we I'll go. tell you Two's what, though. They gained inside. a lot out of 2. They gained a lot out of 4 there that time. Yeah. Well, yeah, this is exactly what the 22 wants to see. They, he wants to see them battling back there. Yeah. Cause yep. Now three they're, wide. they're 3 wide. 2 is split in the middle of both of them. Wow, and what a move by Ding. Coming to 4 to go now. Now, 22 better hope this two car ain't blazing right now up to him because if he is, well, here we yeah, go. Yeah, that two is coming. Four to go. A hey, good is, gamble, is, though, by is Lee. Is he going to have enough time to do it? He's got four more laps. Good. What a strategy, though, by Lee. You can't, you can't diss that out. He tried. I mean, hey, it's still a net gain. He was running, what, probably 7th or 8th? He might end up being 2nd like yeah. or 3rd or 4th in this stage. It's technically a net gain for that 22. He's going to get good track. Yeah, that two is, that two's got him. He's definitely gaining faster out of 2. 3 to go. Out of 4 that time. 3 to go, stage 2. Honestly, I feel like... It's going to be like, a last left pass. Yeah, I feel like three. Lee, no. Lee just nope, slipped up right not there. after that. Here not comes that. the 2. Do, do. Uh, yeah, put do, on do, the do, Jaws do. music. Oh, right down the inside do, 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 yep. do, do, for the lead, do, 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 and he's do, 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 got it. Bye, bye. back to the lead. Come yeah, that didn't take long that 22, if he's smart, he's going to draft off that 22 and just stay up there. Yeah, there we go. Two to go. Yeah, if I was a 22, I would definitely stay with that two and just try to draft what you, what you can and just ride around. I mean, you, you gained, you got second out of the deal. Second, third, or fourth. But... I mean, yeah, that two is showing a lot of speed, but here comes Andy looking to the inside of the 22. Yeah, well, that's a not. far look, bro. That is a far look. My bad, look. I said my bad. <laughs> Man hey, was Andy, looking. Andy, you to the inside of the 22 yet? or? Uh... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, for spoken sake, we need to know. We got one to not go yet. on the he's, stage. He's, he's, he's on the back bumper, though, going into one. Yeah, he is. Now oh, he's to he the inside. That. He said that a little bit. He took that gap. Here we go, one and two. Oh, oh loose, five got a little two. loose. 22 is going to get a little momentum. Here we go, three and four. Oh, the five hit the apron. That's going to check up to 88. Out of oh, oh, five oh, and 22. As the two of Ding's going to win the stage, the 22 is going to get P4. Hey, give the 22 pops, though. That was... I said I said pops. Whoops. Pops? Give, props. give them pops? Yeah, I said pops. I said pops, yeah. Anyway. Give them pops? <laughs> One who anyway. eats pop cereal, anyway. Anyway, give him props, because he... What a... Well, that was a good stage, but two a ding. One stage one, he's going to win stage two here. Stage three is going to get interesting because the 24 is going to have to march himself from the back of the field. Here's the thing, Eric. Will the 24 get paid back for that penalty? I don't know. Oh, no. I, I don't know. Uh, I don't know <laughs> if Collins ever got payback on anyone. No. Here we go, two and five on the front row. Green flag. How many? <laughs> 52 laps. That's going to get interesting. I believe oh. there is two stops this time in, in, in this stage. Yeah, it's going to get interesting. Here we go. Down the back. Oh, the two blocking. Oh. He's blocking. Oh, but that's going to lead to a bad corner from the two. Five's going to hit him up the racetrack a little bit. Five to the inside here. Caleb, is there heading to, for the first lap of stage three? Yeah, I think the, the only chance the five has is just try to stay on his bumper and give him a little bump in the corner. 
because I think once once he gets gone, that that two card's gone now. I don't think the five's gonna be able to hang hang How with him here. But I mean, the five is coming back a little bit. Oh, he gets to the inside and sends it. How about the madhouse though? Back here with uh, the twenty-four, the sixty-six, the eighteen, the twelve, forty-eight. Everybody back here. Fourteen. Uh, I will say, air that the four, that the uh, the two card said earlier today that. He's probably going to dominate, but he's going to mess up and screw himself at some point tonight. So, see what happens. I just also want to bring up the fact that I'm keeping an eye on that five, you know, in this race. He he makes moves into the, like, late into the corners, I feel like. And I feel like that's either going to screw him or somebody else um, late in this race if he makes, if he keeps making those moves like that. For, for some reason, like, right, he would make a move, like, right here. It, I feel like it's yeah, kind of late. Yeah, he did that last time. He hit the apron and lost a, a little bit of ground. Now he's back to the bumper of the two. If he keeps doing I that, he's either going to screw himself or somebody else. Well, he's to the inside now. Well, yeah, now he's clearly on the inside. How and about the dark horse there the in back. third, though, Air? Oh, Hendrick, yeah, he was in the booth. You know, that booth knowledge is starting to help him a little bit. You know. He's doing a really good job sitting in third. The top three have kind of pulled away from that pack as they're just battling. 22's up in oh, the wall. Oh, 22's in the wall. Into the 48. Oh, the reckon. Oh, they saved it. And Andy's going to get a nose out in front in turn two, in turn three and four. Yeah. Can the five, oh, the two in a little run. These two are gonna have to figure something out though. before uh, before help, that third that third place pack, or not third, but fourth place pack, gets back up to them. They gotta figure out some. Well, now that, since the five clears, two and the one are gonna battle for second. If I'm the one, just get in line. There we go. Okay, now if I'm these guys, I stay in line because you don't want more competition in this battle here, Caleb. Yeah, I mean. I feel like the if these top three can get a line going together, they're definitely going to pull away from the backpack. But that backpack is coming right now. Oh, as they're getting side by side for the lead with the two to the inside. The yeah, two to the inside. He really wants to be up front. He feels like he has the best car to get to the front. But the 12, here comes that 12 and those three cars behind him. Looks like slight and uh, I think that's just behind the 12. It's just... Yeah, just behind that the 12. And then there's a pack behind them with Terry, Colin, and looks like uh, the 14 of Jets. So you got cars galore back there. And now more competitions at the front. If you're the two, I'm, I'm trying to run away here, smoking. Yeah, and you know the perfect fact these cars. Look at this. Three horse draft right here down to catch up to the two. Down the back stretch. Gave Hendrick a shot there to get him closer to the two. Now Hendrick going to try to maybe draft with the two for a little bit, but I don't think he's going to. I mean, honestly, I would just ride right now. Still got a long way to go. You got pit stops Twi still. Well, well, the 12 car is not taking your advice. <laughs> no, he's I was like, say he's I ain't not. riding. Oh, two got a little tight up the racetrack. Hendrick down the Here comes the, the one and the five. Oh, Hendrick down the inside. Oh, the two. Five with a shot. One checked up. Oh, the one checked up. That The two car just had the best momentum I think I've seen through three and four all day on the outside. Wow. What yeah, these guys all momentum. go at this like this. These uh, six cars. Look who's in seventh. Well, look who just went to second from being on the outside in fourth, the 12. Yeah, and he's going for the lead now. Yeah, he's going for the lead. He's looking, but can't get there. Here we One go. 18 make contact. Here we go. Three and four. They're having a nice little battle. Tell you what, teammates for the lead, just riding right now. I think, I think honestly, B13's pushed. I think B13's comfortable with riding behind Gang right now. But I mean, I would be too. Slight Savage in the mix with somebody we haven't really talked about. Slight Savage. Remember, he sweeped the races last week. He won both races last week. He's trying to make it three uh, three in a row today. I mean, he did win in the B-Series when he was in the B-Series here at Chicagoland in a hell of a battle, too. 
Oh, 12 got good enough momentum there. He's going to get to the bumper of the two. Give him a nice little push here. So, looking at the top six that are basically in this pack, I think everyone has won a race this season except Hendrick. I don't think Hendrick's won a race this season. And if he did, I don't remember. Has won a race this season, which... Yeah. That was what, I Bristol? I... Was that Bristol? Pocono. Pocono. Yeah, I okay. thought that was Pocono because I was remembering Okay, that yeah, was he won Pocono. Slides got the wall. Slides got like four or five, three or four or five wins this season. Andy only has one. Mm hmm. Shocking. Um, oh, it's, here comes B13. Oh, he's going to get a little you bit of apron. apron. If Zach's going to bring second side by side here, and the five's going to go to P2. B13's got at least three, four, or five wins as well, including the Daytona 500 earlier this earlier this season. Um, and then the two's the question, got about a handful of wins. I guess the big question going right now, while they're just all single file here, is does anybody short pit and try to take that lead strategy in this top six and try to short Ooh. pit and get it up front in front of the ding? Oh, my God. They're about to be four wide almost off of two. Oh. <laughs> It's getting close, bro. They're battling, battling, man. I wouldn't be surprised if somebody got wrecked in this scenario right here. The five's bumping. He ain't afraid to use the bumper. Twelve's trying the outside, and he's almost making it. Oh, there we go. Oh, and Guess they're what? I talked about it. I said it. Two around. And caution. That changes a, a little bit. That changes things just a little bit. Gonna bring that uh, 24 right there. Well, y'all haven't been doing it for the last couple a couple times because I remember a bunch of black flags recently that y'all haven't gave penalties for. But isn't that too late to already make the penalty? Yeah, it's a little late. Yeah, it's a little too late. Yeah. Okay, well, 5 and 18 front row. Green flag. 35. Ooh. Be right That's the end that, of that window. Yes. Is that like a one stop? Well, I mean, stage two was 37, so I mean, so, yeah, is one it stop. possible doing the lead strategy then? Oh, they're almost three wide for the lead, but 18 a slight down the inside. Oh, he hits the apron up the racetrack. Oh, good job keeping it off the five. Though, after hitting the apron, but here comes the 24. He's been easily the second best car of the day with the first best car all the way in the back now. That 24. Oh, down the inside. Three wide for second. And he's going to look for the lead off of two. Oh, 12's going to give a shove to the five. What's the five going to do with that? Nothing. 24 down the inside. Oh, oh the five hanging close to the 24. Oh, 18. 18's going to look three wide almost. 24 to the lead here. Um... Caleb. Yeah, guess who's back? Back again. 24's back. I'm gonna tell no one because I have no friends. Um, that took a dark turn. <laughs> uh, yeah, but I mean, I think honestly, so far this race, I think the only other car that can challenge the 24 and the in the two is that five car. Um. Got the help right now with the 12 behind him, and the two's gonna try to go outside, and oh, they're gonna go three wide for a bit. Well, this bow for second ain't helping no one, though. This bow for second's helping no one but the 24. How about the 48 trying to go four wide going oh, to one? Yeah, three. salt. We could have another crash here the way these guys are making moves the way they are. And I wouldn't be surprised if it happened. You know what? Also, I wouldn't be surprised about the third, the third straight race. We're about to have the 18, the 24, possibly battle it out for the win. <laughs> uh, 
<laughs> we have the hat trick. Now we do have to, you know, kind of talk about the, those those two the races. High side hat trick. Well, well, let me say this: the last two races, Michigan lap car wrecked because I, apparently there was contact with the five and the 66. 66 had a flat tire. Um, 66 spun out in front of the leaders. 24 didn't avoid it as well as the 18 that got the 18 to his rear bumper and then basically 18 gave him a nice little bump in one and two that almost wrecked the 24 18 went on the win gateway there was a nice little battle lap car kind of was two lap cars were kind of hitting each other the 12 tried to get out of the way kind of went on the grass 24 didn't know what to do with that and kind of avoided it not right and the 18 went and won the race I mean, hey, I wouldn't be surprised if that 19 car gets lapped by the end of this race and it might mess up the 24. I'm calling it. <laughs> I mean, I wouldn't be surprised. And it would be literally the hat trick for the 18. It would be three in a row for that for your defending champion. So here we go. Off of turn number four here, smoking. We got four car breakaway. 12, 2, 18, 24. Yeah, I'm not smoking, but uh, those four cars at the front are starting to battle. And that 18 looks like he's getting a little loose towards the front. I guess, do does somebody in this front four pack do that lead strategy and try to short pit and then jump the field and get out in front? Because I feel like if you're this far up, it might be beneficial to do it and s you'll get a big gap out front. Yeah, it's going to be crucial, especially with that one final pit stop you're going to have to do. Green flag, if it's green flag or not. Right now, we don't know because there could possibly be a caution brewing in that second pack back there, in all honesty, the way they're racing. I mean, there could be a second caution. But you got 24, you got the 12, you got the 2, you got the 18. You got those four cars. All four of them, you could possibly debate. Champ uh, championship four right there. Pre-prediction, pre you can predict all four of them championship four. I mean, the way the 12 season has gone, he's he's one of the favorites. The way the 18 is, the defending champion, the way his season's been, he can make the final four. The way the 24 season has been, he can make the 24 or the final four. The two is the question. That fourth driver, I feel like, is up in the air right now, and I don't know who that fourth driver currently is. It, it could be a mixture of three or four drivers right now where I'm struggling, like, could they make the final four? Well, Air, you want to know something cool? What? Guess where the final four race is this year. You're looking at it. Oh, Chicago. That's going to be huge. Is it the night those race? Those four cars Chicago? are all at the front. Then, uh, wait a minute. Hold uh, up. Uh, Smoking. Hold on. Hold on. This game has been out for how it. long? And you've, raced this race, and you've raced this game for how long? And it's been out for how long? And you just asked for a night race? Well, okay. <laughs> yeah, we're going to we're gonna run the Chicago street race. God. That's anyway... Bad. Anyway, no, we're not we're not done with this. <laughs> yes, we're done. No, we aren't. Yes, we are. Oh no, we're not. This man just said the Chicago Land Night Race. I am, I am done. <laughs> I am done. <laughs> Officially, bro. I think he smoked the last of his brain cells in the bowl he left the weed in, bro. I swear he did. Oh my God. <laughs> uh. Ay ay. <laughs> God smoking. You are literally the comic relief. Thank you. Um, <laughs> oh. Hey, I mean, it wouldn't be it wouldn't be the A series broadcast without me being dumb at some point. At some point, you've been dumb the whole race. <laughs> uh. hmm. Caleb and smoking, talking shit, never gets old. Never gets old. <laughs> the thing is, the only uh, thing is, oh, you don't get the twelve to, together. You don't get to hear Caleb's reply because he's racing. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> that 18 and 24 have checked out on the 2 and 12 right now. Yeah, because the 2 and 12 keep battling. 
which is not helping them. 18-24, not battling. 2 and no, 12. That five is slowly battling. creeping into that picture. Yep, he is slowly creeping in. Six is also kind of there too, right behind the five. I mean, I think that's Hendrick or, or um. You mean the one? Yeah, the one of Hendrick. Yeah, I think it's the one of Hendrick. Then the 88 is right behind yeah, him, the, and they're gonna form a draft partners here and see if they can't get back up here to the front. Yeah, I mean, this race ain't over. Definitely, one one pit mistake can definitely end your race right here. If it doesn't bring out a caution, <laughs> even though, but if you have your well, second strike, that can also end your race. Well, honestly, look at Ding. He doesn't need anybody drafting with him because he's there with the freaking 18 right now going into three. He has one of the best cars all night. I mean, definitely. He can just drive up to cars and pass and pull away. Question is, will he run over somebody on pit road again? That's going to be the big question. <laughs> Watch it be the 24 again. If I was again. the cars racing him, I would pit a whole lap before him. I would either pick before him or make sure I'm behind him. <laughs> Maybe I can screw him in on, on the entry. Here road. comes the five to pit road. Oh, a little short pit from the five. That's interesting. Well, I mean, it's a gamble. Go for it. I mean, hey, you know, you're that far back. You feel like you got a car or a good car. Gotta do something. There you go. He just said it. <laughs> Gotta try something out. Oh, 18, two up the racetrack. 24 looks like he's pitting. 18 looks like, oh, 24 fakes out. 18's gonna stay out again. Good heads up by the 18, because a lot of people have fallen for that trick with the 24 where he fakes signals. Um, this oh, is- Oh, need a jerk. <laughs> I mean, good job by the 18, not falling for it. I mean, I got to give him props. I think he well, got loose. I think he just like whispered he got loose. just got loose. Yeah, I think he just whispered that. <laughs> he whispered it because he wants to make sure no one else knows that he's fake signaling. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, or maybe because he, he has to, he, even though he has to whisper, maybe he has to whisper. Five cars exiting? <laughs> Ouch. God. I mean... Oh, 12 spun it? Oh, yeah, well, that's one car out of the equation. 12 car spins it. So, that's one That's one gain <laughs> for everyone behind them. Question is, what the... And here they all come. Oh, here, here they, they come. come. Oh, 24's in the grass. 18's in the grass. 18's going to try to pass both of them through the grass. Oh, oh. Two. Eight, eight, oh. Eight's around. Oh, eight, eight's around. He's going to lose the spot to the 48, but what a pit entry from the two. Because the two is basically even with the 24 now. Yeah, they. that's, well, wow. Oh, who got the pass through penalty? 19. Oh, 19. Oh, 2 and 24. Oh, my God. They're inside each other. Oh, God. Yep. Oh, oh this is going to be bad. Well, this is going to be interesting <laughs> because the 24 <laughs> oh! and the 2. Oh, 2. I think the 2 oh. kind of let off there. It was a smart decision. But the and 5 to the lead. 5 to the lead. The short pit. It's gonna put the five, but the thing is, 24 and two's got at least two or three lap fresher tires. Oh, <laughs> five's in the wall. Oh, five in the wall, okay. Make it easier for the 24 and the two to get you. Don't worry. <laughs> 18's just sitting back there, dude. The way, I know the five's aggressive. I know the two wants to win, the 24 wants to win. Bro, I think the 18 could be in the catbird seat the way these, this mixture could mix together. Well, I'm going to say this. If the two did not 
the two did not the two came in behind the 18 but put, drove all the way by both him and got up to the 24 so that's where the two got that's where the two put him in that position is they're gonna they're catching andy right here going into one Rule five, five's trying to defend. Here we go, three and four. Oh, a little defending, a little bumper touching. Oh, here we go. This is the battle. Two looking inside, two. Oh, 24 almost chops the two. Oh, here we go, five and 24, battling for the lead. He gone. Oh, well, the thing is the five can just hold on. Once the two gets by him, I think I think the five could take advantage of the two and the twenty-four. That's going to be the that's going to be the thing. If he can just hold on, thing is that's going to help the eighteen as well. The eighteen's going to look underneath the five here. How many to go? Eleven to go. Look at the two coming to the outside oh, of one two. That's not going to be a good move. Oh, maybe it is. Hold on. Hold he's going to get a hell of a run on he's, exit. He got a really good run. He's looking outside of the 24 because he knows oh. the 24 is going to defend inside. Oh, yeah, for sure. Oh. Yeah, look at the run he's going to get out of four. What though, a right run. Here. He pulled a move Moving similar to that. And the whole, cleared oh. the whole race car. Oh, a little contact. Oh, the 18's looking three. The 18's thinking three. I mean, the two Ooh. made that move, and he's still there on the outside. Oh, uh, not two. anymore. 18's going to get down the inside now. Uh, this, don't. This is what the 24 wants. This is what the 24 wants. He wants that 18 to get by the two, I feel like. I feel like 24 can defend the 18 better than he can defend the two. Yeah, but don't count out that two because you know he's he's done it before. He's made it three wide. He's going to do it again if he can. 20, 24 is blocking like crazy. He's going too. He's like Dale planes. Jr. out there managing lines, man. <laughs> right? More like, he's yeah, he's like, more like Dale Jr. He's, out of play Dale track. Jr. <laughs> yep. 18's by the two. Yep, there goes the 18. Question is can 18 make the pass? Nope. I don't think so because the two's coming to the right inside. back. How many to go? Eight, Eight to go. Okay. Tell you what, the two is back. And the five is still hanging with these three. The five never left, yeah. Yeah, 24 is defending <laughs> the, the inside. The five just got the high off that exit and he go. <laughs> he go. Yeah, 24. Here three comes Ding again on the on outside. The outside is going to be the move. The way Ding's the taking it. The, the way the tw is seven to go. The way the 24 has been blocking three and four, it has slowed down his momentum so much, the two gets a run on the outside. Outside of three and four might be the move the two needs to make on that final I mean, he, lap. He's making it He's making it work on the outside of one and two, yeah. too. Yeah, because look how the 24, and, he has to enter a little shallow. He loses that momentum. Mm -hmm. He enters way Dang too to the outside. shallow. Yeah, he's looking outside. Thing is, he's got to get immediately back down the inside to defend that 18. Oh! He's looking. He was trying to cross over there. Oh, he let the door open, but he shut it. He shut it quickly. We're down to six to go, by the way. Coming to five. We're going to be coming to five, yeah. Look, yeah, this is not good because the two's on the outside. 24's going to have to enter shallow. It's also going to put the 18 in a good position to battle with the two for second. Oh, but no, the, the two's going to get good momentum here. He's going to clear the 18. Yeah, and you you can tell the two wants to go to the bottom, but he that wants 24 to. is blocking. But he knows the 24's entries in the three and four. Oh, oh, this oh, is the move. Oh, look at this. This is there the move. There it is right there. To, to the slip inside. Up on the 24. 18. 18's going to follow. Does the 18 go make it three oh, wide? three wide. Two to the lead. Oh, 24 is going to get the momentum. Watch for the 24. Oh, 24 way high off of off of four. I think it's going to be four to go here. Four to go. Oh, four to go. The two to the lead. 
He's going to have to defend. <laughs> Come, we're going to be coming to three. Oh, 24 <laughs> with a little contact on the 18. That, that's what the that two That just needed. let the two go away. Yeah. That just let the two go away. And they're going to stay side by side here Not a little going. bit. Three to go. Yeah, the big move of the race was that two making that, that swap. The 24 loose getting loose in turn three and four. Two took advantage of All it. All you got to do is pull away. If you're if you Just manage the gap. We're coming to two to go this time. Well, here we go. Three and four coming to two to go. If you're There's the two, question, can... you got to defend. Two to go. Just defend. 24 is back. Oh. Oh, yeah, the two. Oh, oh, 24, a huge runoff quarter exit. Oh, but that two's oh, blocking. Oh, contact. Oh, the 24 is going to use the same way the two is trying to use that outside on him. But the two is actually going to block the outside. Smart decision by the two. Side by side. White flag. White flag. Oh, here comes Savage. The slide steal it. Savage 18 to the inside. 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 What a what a race! Oh, 24 could be into. looking three wide here down the back. Oh, you know the, the 24 is gonna go three wide. He's gonna have to go you three know wide the 24 is gonna go for it. Oh We're boy, both boy! Of them. Here we go. Third, three, and four, three wide. Push wing. him up the track. 24 goes wide. Slight and is gonna steal turn it. Number four, Slight is gonna go three in a row and win at Chicago. Wow. Wow, what a finish! What a race! What a finish! Three wide, three and four. I did not. One to go. And the 18 is going to win three in a row for the 18. A. Those two went. You knew Colin was going to try to go four, three wide there, but what a move. I mean, it was a good defense. Slight. I mean, it was a good defense by Slight. Slight kind of pinched the 24 in that middle and made the 24 tight to get into the two. So it's a good. it was a good defense. You can't blame the 18 for a really good defense. Well, right what a move you in can't turn blame one. the 18 when he goes and doors the shit out of you. Results, Colin. So let it finish. What a finish, though. That was a really ignore good, that. Really good race. Smoking just sent us a game invite. I don't know what. I'm gonna take it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, let's go ahead. Let's get to the interviews here. Let's go ahead and uh, go to your third place finisher today mr ding who gets it done p3 after winning both stages ding you got copy there buddy make sure your audio is included yes sir um a good a good run for you you got two stage wins but <sighs> falls short in the race um just tell us what you could have done differently there in those last final laps to secure the win uh, it would have been nice to not find the right shot of my car against the wall and turn three and four, but, uh, you know, me and Colin were having a, other than our incident on pit road, but uh, I'm glad he recovered from that. But me and him were having a super fun battle there at the end there. And uh, unfortunately some contact, uh, took that fun out of it. So, uh, not a, not the finish I wanted, but I'll take a top three, I guess. Yeah, top three indeed. Um, but two stage wins. How co good do you feel after this race? At least you got the two stage wins and a good points day. Uh, I'd like to feel better because I still have yet to win a Chicago race for points. Uh, I, you know, I lead a, a lot of laps here. I just can't lead the one that matters. Okay. Well, anything you want to say or shout out here before we move on to second? And I'll shout out to you for having the stream, Colin, for having the uh, the league and uh, always fun racing. Okay, well, congratulations on P3. Wish you good luck for Canadian Tire on Thursday. Oh, that'll be a good one. Yeah, that will be definitely interesting. 
Um, let's go to your second place finisher, the man who had a very up and down day, if you ask me. I mean, he's been everywhere. Uh, high side Hobie. Uh, gets it done P2 today. Hi, Sai. You got copy there, buddy. Make sure your IO is included. Mm -hmm. I'm here. Hello. Well, um, you know, you've been up and down all day. Tell us how you made the comeback there to at least get a top three today. Fast car. That's about all I can say. I mean, when I was uh, back at the start of stage, was it stage three? When I had to recover from that. Yeah, I had a tough time in the first five laps making it through the field, and then uh, <laughs> I got myself within point seven, and then everybody decided to die, which caused that caution. So that's kind of what really came down to. Is I was able to get up to the the pack, I just couldn't pass them because I had to get through everybody else and kind of burn my tires. Yeah, definitely, indeed. Um, but uh, let's go through that final lap. You were leading with like what to go like maybe what five four to go there and then the two made the move and then the 18 made the move on the white flag what could you have done differently in those last five laps that could have secured you the win today no i did exactly what i wanted to do with five to go i let them take control i let them make the mistakes but uh the unfortunate part is uh with the 18 uh, washing up in uh, whatever turn that was, three, where he would have uh, said, oh, if, if either I or Ding did it, he would have been like, ah, oh, Ding, or oh, Colin, and then he does it and practically puts us kind of both in the wall in the last lap after the clean racing we've had. It's kind of shitty. So, I mean, I did everything I was supposed to do, so did the two car. I got back in the catbird seat, knew he was going to do something stupid. I just didn't realize it was going to involve both of us. Um, that's pretty much all I have to say about that. That's three in a row I've had stolen from me from him, whether it was him packing me at Michigan, him getting lucky with a lap car, or then sending both I and Ding in the wall. Um, with as clean as he quote-unquote is during the middle of the race, uh, he, uh, he turns into a uh, B-Series driver at the end. Okay, well, anything you want to say or shout out here before we move on to your winner? Shout out to two-car. Him and I always have great races here. Um, I forget who else I was even racing around tonight. Um, I would have said shout out 18 until those last couple laps. But uh, at this point, it's kind of up yours because that's three weeks in a row. And I think not only myself, but I'm pretty sure Ding's pretty upset with it. But uh, always thank you to you. Thank you to Caleb, even though he didn't have to stay around. He, he did. And then uh, also smoking for actually saying more than five words this time. <laughs> Let's go. Okay. Well, congratulations on your P2. See Wish you good day. luck for Canadian Tire, possibly. I know you're going to be I at the Darlington, which will be uh, may which will, or may, may, not, may be or not. Yeah. So you may hear me in the background of things, but I may not be racing. Okay. I may be shittered. I don't know. I'll be seeing him Thursday. Let's go. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Concrete. Right. Bye. Well, let's go to your winner here today, Slight Savage, three in a row. Oh, yeah, what a run for this 18 car, your defending series champion. Slight, you got a copy there, buddy? Make sure your audio is included. Yeah, I got you, bud. Slight. Yeah, I got you. Okay, good, good, good. Um, well, you come out with the dub today. You know, it's a shocking dub because you weren't really the best car. You were mainly back half of the top five, somewhere around the top ten. What helped you get up into that winning position there at the end of the race? Uh, just that caution. I uh, was able to stay with the lead pack, and that draft really helped me. I, uh, I caught a good launch in the try over there, and I would take it just like everybody else would. And uh, we're three wide there. You know, There's only so much you could do when you're hugging the bottom. I think uh, the 24 and the 2 expected me to let off and just let them have it, and that ain't the case with me. Uh, you know, I ain't going to trash talk anybody. It was good racing all night. But uh, racing's racing, and uh, just got to get them how you can take them. Okay, well, um, you know, it, you know, three in a row, you know, you know, three in a row is hard to do, you know, winning three straight. I mean, how does it feel to get three straight wins in your championship defense season here in high side? Oh, uh, yeah, it's... It's just like another race to me. I uh, just come here, enjoy myself, and uh, it's good to get three in a row. But uh, it's like everybody else, I'd be upset, and everybody gets upset. They try to blame me for their fuck-ups. 
you know, if people watch the stream, they see what happened last week at Michigan. But I guess I'll take the fall for that one and this one and all the lap cars that get in the way of the 24, the races he screws himself out of. I guess I'll just take blame for that and, uh, yeah, just try to move on to next week. Okay. Well, anything you want to say or shout out here uh, before we end the stream? Yes. Yeah, shout out to you for streaming. I would say shout out to the other guys, but uh, apparently there's a little bit of beef going on, so we'll just save that for Thursday. Did he just say beef? He said beef. Yes. Okay. Uh, well, congratulations on the win. We wish you good luck for Canadian Tire. You know, do you think you got any chance of making a four in a row to, at Canadian Tire? I uh, just watch the stream. You'll be impressed. Okay. Okay. Well, I think that's where we're gonna end it tonight. Uh, some drama, some good racing. I said it in my tweet on Twitter. Um, I also want to shout out. I want to shout out real quick. Uh, Costa Oils, bro. That like every single tweet that I put up for High Side, and you know, I I, I want to shout them out because I'm pretty I'm pretty happy to have them liking all my tweets. You know, they sponsor Ryan Ellis in the Xfinity series. You know. Maybe uh, maybe they can sponsor us soon, you know, wink, wink, uh-huh, uh, wink, yeah. Uh, but I want to shout them out because it means a lot to me that they're uh, liking my tweets. Um, but, uh, you know, I like to shout out everyone that uh, that's watching. Of course, six people watched tonight. You know, y'all, I mean, that means a lot to me. Uh, the B-Series race had 11 people watching for that Canadian Tire Chicagoland weekend. That was pretty cool. But, um, you know, I like to shout out. Smoking and Caleb for being in the booth. Um, Caleb didn't need to be, Got but it there. means a lot that Caleb uh, went into the booth tonight. You know, shit talk, smoking a little bit, got, brought in some great insight. Um, it was a fun night Always. indeed. Yeah, it was a fun night indeed. And then smoking for being smoking. Uh, I gotta thank smoking. Uh, but yeah, definitely, y'all like to shit talk each other. It's just, it's funny. It's, it's easy. funny that the stream can just finally hear it now the the comebacks caleb has okay it's so easy <laughs> i mean he sets himself up for it it's sad god i mean he's a yankees fan so it's just i mean oh god okay well we're gonna end the stream thank y'all for watching if you're on if you're on youtube like comment subscribe if you're on twitch drop a follow i'm Aaron just cause We'll see you guys next time. Thank you all for watching.